Lin Chan and Dimi Chan play games. And welcome everyone. Today we're playing Luigi's Mansion. Welcome, Chan Chan. How how's everyone been doing? Good. 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 We're uh. pretending to be everyone. Uh. I'm doing good. I'm doing good. I'm good. I'm fine. Wow, I, there's a lot of people in the studio today. <laughs> If you could call our small room a studio. Well, in any case, we're going to be playing Luigi's Mansion. And I haven't played this game in a long time. Long, long yesterday. A long, long yesterday. <laughs> Except I did play this game because I practiced. Because we previously recorded. And I had no idea where I was going. Uh, so we I... didn't previously record this. You did a live stream. Oh, uh, yeah. So uh, I didn't know what I was doing. So I, I decided it's, time, it's a good idea to practice. Mm -hmm. Uh, and that way we at least can make some sense while we're playing, right? Yeah. <clears throat> so the game goes that you are Luigi and you won uh, via a raffle or something. A gigantic mansion! Yay! So let's, let's go explore gigantic mansion. I think Luigi's <laughs> cold. Look at his nose. <laughs> uh, won't they give him more clothes? I don't know. Um, but, yeah, so, here we are in our newly acquired mansion. He's looking for his, uh, for Mario, isn't he? No, not yet. He doesn't know Mario came here. Oh, he doesn't know Mario came here. No, stop, stop giving it away. Oh. <laughs> Ooh, and there are spooky ghosts in this game. This game is old, though. Oh, yeah, it's very old. Yeah, so everyone knows it already. Or maybe not. Did you know it? No, the, until you told me. The, there you go. Like, last week. <laughs> so, as it turns out, this is a mansion haunted with ghosts and very realistic looking gigantic keys. That's only. That's like three times. <laughs> uh, not his size. Is it three times his size? No, three times his size, meaning it's three times bigger than his size. It's a. Uh, life size. <laughs> it's a it's life size key. No, and and was, now it became no, really small. Look how small it came. How do you say it? It's uh, when he was showing it, it was like three fourths of his height. Oh, there you go. There you go. There you go. Three fourths of his size. That key. Oh. Do you think he's scared or cold? Well, I, I'd say scared. And the vacuum cleaner to the rescue with an old man that looks like a toddler. He has a snuggle tooth. He has a one tooth. He has a snuggle <laughs> tooth. <laughs> well, it's on the side. <laughs> he uses it to to get the the good part out of the out of the of the clams when he eats. The scrape. <laughs> <laughs> oh, ouch! Oof! I sure take a lot of knocks in this line of work. I'm getting too old for this ghost catching tomfoolery. Anyway, nice to meet you. I'm Professor Egad. Anyway. This house, I swear, it seems to have more ghosts every day. What's a young feller like you doing around here, anywho? Anywho. Ooh. Uh oh, this looks ugly. Alright, youngster. Look lively. Follow me. Post taste. Post taste? Post taste. So yeah, our name's Luigi, and we came to this mansion because we thought we... Our name is Luigi? <laughs> yeah, our name is Luigi. We're both playing Luigi. <laughs> I go, ma, and you go, Leo! Exactly. Um, and apparently he's he's lived here this, his, his whole life, and all of a sudden a mansion came out of nowhere. So... Uh, he's like, well, this you didn't win anything. That's That's a fake mansion, and it's full of ghosts. And of course, Luigi's afraid of ghosts. And uh, apparently, someone else came first before Luigi, with a red hat. And that was uh, Luigi's brother, uh, Red Red Luigi. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, basically, Mario went in. He got captured, uh, and the the wonderful Luigi has to go and save him. So then who's in charge of like this sweepstake thing that tricked them into winning? 
I don't know. We're going to have to find out. Oh, there's a big boss then. <laughs> yeah. That's, that's going to come at the end of the series. So first we need to learn how to use a vacuum cleaner to suck up ghosts. It's the Poltergeist 3000. Poltergust. It's Polter, like in Poltergust. Ghostbusters. Yep. Clearly. Is this based off of Ghostbuster? Not like the story isn't, but I'm sure a bunch of the ideas are. So Let's now... Go. go ahead. Was Ghostbuster before this game? Oh, way before. This came out in like right. 2001 or something. So we need a flashlight them and suck them. Because that's how ghosts work. Of course. So you see their hearts and then their hearts beat, then you can suck them up. Um, and if you're not fast enough because your controller is ancient, then they don't get sucked up. <laughs> Help support us so we can get a new controller. <laughs> we need to buy we need to buy retro because this is a GameCube game. <laughs> hey, that's too many. How am I supposed to get all these at once? Why isn't the professor helping? I mean, he he knows his place better than anyone. Yeah. He's just he's just like in his room now. It's like cheering on. Yep. <laughs> and he's converted and a, it, a a good old Game Boy into a Game Boy horror. And, and he sent Luigi, who is like so afraid of everything, to go yeah. and fight off ghosts. So, so I've recently been playing the. The the sequel to this game that came out way later for the 3DS, the Dark Moon, uh, Luigi's Mansion Dark Moon, um, and he knows very well that Luigi is terrified of ghosts, and he's like, "Go in there, bye." <laughs> <laughs> With no guidance. Yeah, no guidance. So now we can get revenge on the the ghosts. Bye bye. Bye bye. You can do it, Luigi. Ooh, look at those realistic shadows. And those textures. Wait, where was he at before? If he wasn't already in the mansion. What do you mean? Just now when he was- Oh, they were in door. his lab, which is like a little, oh, a little so, house on the- So then he was at the mansion and then he went to the lab to talk to the professor again? Yeah, so the professor uh, rescued him and then brought him with him to the lab. So. Of course, there are lots of yellow toads everywhere, so and they're like, cute. Luigi! It's so cute. Throat scratching toads. Uh, and basically, they went, huh? they went in trying to find Mario, and they couldn't find Mario. So they just started crying because there are lots of ghosts, and uh, now they just turn into safe points. Oh, they went in to find Mario. Mm -hmm. Were they with Mario? I don't think they went in at the same time. They went in after. Like, who are they, and why are they looking for Mario? Um, because Mario eats his relatives. He likes mushrooms very much, and <laughs> he's made of mushroom, and they want him to eat him. That's like their goal in life, is for Mario to eat, to eat them. To eat them. Got it. Makes them happy. Sounds fun. So this game is full of money. That's like the, the, the end goal of this game is to get rich off your mansion that did not exist so far. Well, the end, you look he, here, he's still can, a rich man. You can vacuum up all the coins and no. check all the vases. Oh, look at all those coins. Right? I'm rich already. Oh, you're saying Luigi's rich? Yeah, in the end, he's still a rich man. Like, he went because he thought he he, uh, he won a mansion, but he's still leaving with money. Yeah. Oh, he's, he's, he's going to leave with more than just money. Did. Yeah. He's going to have diamonds and then the... Chandelier Those are really is gonna... big coins. Oh, they're gigantic, like the keys. <laughs> and then you can like suck up drapes. Why? It's a fun game to suck stuff up. But let's enter this room that that got us before, and look at all the coins. It's like they're expecting us to just vacuum up coins. It's like that one trick where you pull the the tablecloth off the table without mm -hmm. uh, disturbing anything on it. <laughs> yep. You can do that a lot in this game. But 
need to get rich first. That's the primary goal. Because if you're going to be fighting ghosts, you better do so on a fat wallet. <laughs> <laughs> she can bribe some of them uh, to take it easy on you. I don't think you can bribe any of them. But on, on the new game, I'm trying to like vacuum everything because that works in this game. And you can't vacuum anything to get coins. You need to like touch them. Who put out my candles, you, Mr. Grimer? Well, dark rooms are dangerous around here, yes. They love the dark. And they will get you, blah. Now you're in for blah. Just like little red cap before you. May you wander lost in darkness forever. So mean. <laughs> are you afraid of the dark, little man? Are you, huh, blah. Here they are now. And that's like the scariest point in this whole game. <laughs> hey, those are my coins. Come on, ghosties. We'll take the heart. Yep. <laughs> Mario. Mario. And then when you get all the ghosts, it lights up and you can get a treasure chest. Oh, always check the chandeliers. There's always stuff in the chandeliers. Of course. Of course there's nothing in the chandelier. Yeah, you took it off. And we got a, a key that's conveniently going to the door right there. <laughs> so, let's explore. Explore the ghost mansion. The key shrunk like... I know, it starts off so big. Times. And then it just like, gets so tiny. <clears throat> I don't know what's going on there. <gasps> what's gonna happen? You're locked Who's in gonna there, attack right? us? You're locked in there, right? Maybe we'll find out next time. Yeah. Bye, everyone. Bye, bye. See we continue. Ding yi cha, len cha na da ding yi cha an, len cha an ding yi cha len cha an, len cha len cha an ding yi cha na na len cha an 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 an. Then tidy me, cha 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 c